James Big Dave Racing at Rose Hill on Saturday. Start off in the Reginald Atlan Handicap. You've got Saskia, 1400 a trip. She's a three year old reduced choice for late. Look, we had her in uh, today at Warwick Farm, uh, today being Wednesday, but uh, she unfortunately drew wide, so she's going to head to the 1400 metre race on Saturday, which is <clears throat> a bit uh, above her grade at the present time. But, um, you know, we're just living, uh, living in hope, thinking positively that she draws well there and she can just run a little bit better. She's still a maiden after two starts. Uh, has she taken improvement in learning from those two runs? Oh, look, she has a little bit. We're going to put the winkers on her. Um, but, you know, she's, uh, if, if she was to be running on and sort of finishing thereabouts in the money, we'd be happy with her in a race like that. What sort of opinion do you have for this filly? Oh, she's, you know, she's out of a, a group winning mare. Um, she's a full sister, I think I do. Um, we, we like her, but I think she's six months away. In the 2,000 metre handicap, you got a couple of runners. Start off with Tamanu Park, who finished well back in the Newcastle Cup last week. Yeah, he, uh, he he was well beaten in the staying event there that day, so we've just brought him back to um, a distance that he's performed at. Um, although he's run a place in a, in a mile and a half race at Rose Hill before, it was, it was a slow tempo, and the other day was um, was a harder race and also, also run at a stronger clip. So... I think that um, the drop back in distance will suit him and probably the last the last run of his prep, he, he, uh, he'll get his chance to go out in a bang. How did he come through that run? Well, he came through it really well. Um, he, he, he definitely looks well and uh, expect him to parade well on Saturday. Um, he's a, he's a, he, he can be a grinder, so he'll be, he'll be there. and he'll, um, you know, If he's uh, the horse he was two starts ago, he'll be there till the end. And what's the plan for next preparation for him? Have you got an idea? Oh, look, he's... He's, he's, he's sort of just gonna, got to go through his grades really and find his level. Um, I don't think the, I don't think um, I, he's a nice horse, but but he's 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 just going to probably remain at that level for, for the sort of horse that he is, you know. Kim Devine runs in the same race. Yeah, Kim Devine. Uh, he ran well last start, and um, and he'll run a big race on Saturday. Very happy with him. Um, you know, hopefully he can uh, he, he can get back into winning form and then sort of put himself back into the spring because uh, he, he, uh, <clears throat> his first two runs sort of didn't indicate that he wanted to take that step forward but now he's going a lot better. Um, the tracks have hardened up and things that he's liking. Where would you like to see him in the run on Saturday? Oh, we'd like to see him draw well so we can, we can, we can be a little bit closer without having to do anything because he does like to be left alone in the early stages of his races. If that was to eventuate then you know, he'd be a very strong chance of winning that race. And what's the plan with him for the rest of the spring? Look, if he was to win that, then there might be some consideration of running him in the uh, Metropolitan, but um, we'll see what happens.